guys! So for today's video, I'm going to be talking about Facebook. Now Facebook is one of those things that I have a love-hate relationship with. Some days I really like it, most days I don't. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about five things that I absolutely hate about Facebook and hopefully some of you guys will be able to relate a little bit. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that I absolutely hate about Facebook is the attention seekers. The people who intentionally put their status as, ugh, I'm so mad right now, or oh my god, how could this happen? And they do it so that they can invite everyone they're friends with to show concern and ask them what is wrong. And I know whenever this happens, I always get this overwhelming curiosity. Like, I need to know what this person's problem is too. Luckily, there's always that one person, that one very brave person who asks, what's wrong? Can I help you? Are you okay? So you're like, all right, I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to figure out what's going on here. But then the person who made the status comments back and says, I'll text you. I'll inbox you. We'll talk about it. And then your heart breaks because you know that you're never going to figure out what the person's problem was. So sad. <laughs> I guess the thing that I don't really understand is if you didn't want to talk about something publicly, then why put it on Facebook? Because there are so many people like me who want to know what's going on and never quite figure it out. It's always a disappointment. The second thing I hate about Facebook is the braggers, the people who post 500 pictures of their 10-day cruise of the Bahamas, or the people that post a picture of their brand new fully loaded car that I would never be able to afford. Those people are literally the killjoys of Facebook because they make the rest of us feel like insignificant, boring, unadventurous human beings, and I don't like it. The next thing that I hate about Facebook is the gym pictures and the gym statuses. I honestly couldn't care less if you're going to the gym. That is perfectly fine. You do you, but I don't think the rest of us need to really know about it, you know? I don't care if it's leg day, or ab day, or bicep day, or whatever day it is. Just too much information. What's even worse, though, is the girls on my newsfeed who go to the gym. They love to pose pictures, so many pictures, of their skinny bodies and bathing suits so that all the guys they're friends with can give it likes and comments. And it's just really annoying. Maybe the reason why it's so annoying to me, though, is because all these pictures always show up on my newsfeed when I'm eating a donut or something. <laughs> I'm not at the gym, I'm eating donuts. The fourth thing I hate about Facebook is all the game requests. And I know on this one, I'm definitely not alone. I feel like I get about two game requests per day. And this is always how it goes. I log on to Facebook, I see I have a notification, so I click on it because I think I'm important. And then it's a game request. A game request. I wish I could make it clear to people that I don't want to harvest crops in Farmville, and I don't want to crush candy in Candy Crush, and I don't want to gamble in Slotomania. Not today, not tomorrow, not ever. The fifth and final thing that I absolutely hate about Facebook is all the weird love that goes on. I feel like Facebook has become this new place for people to profess their love for someone they just met. Like, just met three hours ago, now they're ready to get married. Weird. 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 Also, the number of couples I see breaking up and getting back together on Facebook on a daily basis is astonishing. Like, one minute they're ready to murder one another, and then the next minute they upload a picture of them kissing and making out, and they're perfectly fine. I honestly, I can't even keep up sometimes. So just for the sake of me adding a little positivity into this video, I'm going to talk about one thing that I do like about Facebook, and that is the Facebook fights. Now, I love me a good TV show, but there is something about a Facebook fight that is so much more entertaining. I go grab myself some popcorn and a drink, and I sit down and I read every single comment, and I love it. Reading a good Facebook fight makes me feel like I don't have a single problem. I do have problems, but when I read a Facebook fight, I'm fine. If it weren't for the Facebook fights, my Facebook might even be deleted right now because I get so annoyed every time I log on, but it is the Facebook fights that keep me coming back. I realize it's kind of wrong to laugh at other people's expense, but if you're going to publicly fight on Facebook, I think you kind of deserve to be laughed at a little bit. Good quality, trashy entertainment. You have to love it. So guys, those are just some of the things that I absolutely hate about Facebook, but I hope you enjoyed this video and felt like you could relate to it a little bit. So I think that's going to be it for today, but I hope you guys have an absolutely fantastic day, and I will see you in my next video. I don't want to rescue pets in Animal Rescue Saga. <laughs> I don't think that's a game. Is that a game? 
animal rescue saga?